The Field Audit Trail Cockpit, powered by RevCult, has provided users the ability to be able to set field audit trail tracking and policies without having to go through the metadata API. So from here, we have the account object we're looking at. We see that history tracking is enabled and we can see all the account fields within this object. So from here, I've got account name and I also want to add account source, reason for leaving, primary consultant, phone, and customer sense. And I want to update the policies for the account, which will take just a few moments here. So while that's working, I can understand here the number of fields tracked. We can see that that just changed from one to six. The archive amount, and what that says is how long this will be stored within Salesforce. So after the number of months selected, historical information will be archived. And then the retention is set at a maximum of 10 years, but we can edit that to let's say eight. We can edit 18 to a number less than that. We'll keep that there. And then the grace period. So after that initial archive date, how long do we have to be able to access that information? So we can have up to 10 years. So I'll set it to six and then update the policies for the account. So this becomes a much more efficient way of having a user interface to be able to archive information, retain it, and then select that grace period all through a user interface powered by RevCult.